Hey, what's going on, my beautiful people? First off, I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who has subbed to me within these past few days. And thank you for all the love you guys showed me on my Yes, I Said It video in regards to haters. I really didn't think I would get that kind of response. But I want to say thank you, and I'm glad it was... Um, encouraging and helping somebody else along the way that was the main focus of that video this video is in response to miss hawaii nana aka miss vanessa what's up girl if you don't know who she is go check her out i will put a link to her page well i'll try to put a link to the video because i'm not for sure when she'll get the video response anywho it's about um she was talking about how she's having an a problem with there isn't a lot of color choices as far as foundation goes in her store uh, stores in regards like um, Dollar General I think she said something about a Navy like the Navy base store or whatever you know in a military basis you know stores like that and even well probably Walmart too well at least I know my Walmart from experience I know that Talking to the managers or a store department manager or whatever, I know in my area, because I can count on literally one hand how many of us there is where I live at. And when I say us, I don't mean just uh, black people, but I'm talking about um, Native Americans, Asians, basically people of all darker skin tones, anybody that is not Caucasian. And um, around here, what they do is if they get a high demand, as far as if I was to go to them and be like, you know what, you really don't have a good selection for women of color. Can you please, you know, you know, get in foundations for darker skin tones? And they will do it, but they have to have a high demand for, for it. If somebody will keep, you know, requesting, will people keep requesting and keep on asking, then they can go ahead and order it. Also, oh, I thought I heard my husband. <laughs> anyway, also, um, I know another one is depending on the store and depending on what the line is. Hold on one second, you guys. All right, I'm back. Depending on the store and the line, it is based off of whatever that company gives them. Like if it's L'Oreal, Maybelline or whatnot, they have to take whatever the company shipped them. They don't even like really go by what they sell. Well, I'm pretty sure they do go by as what they sell in as far as the shades and stuff. But sometimes whatever they give them is what the store takes and then it is what it is. Because... I even asked, because our Dollar Tree, like literally, I used to be in there every single day. And when I seen they started carrying L'Oreal foundations, of course, not one dark enough for, for me. I don't even think they got one dark enough in that line anyway. But anywho, I went and I asked her because the foundations, they only even had either one or two bottles of each shade. So I went and I asked her, and I was like, you know, excuse me. Why do you only have one bottle? Because I was interested. I was like, because, you know, I'm in here all the time. It Did it sell that quick? And she was like, no. It's because that's what they gave us. That's what basically we're going to sell. They're not going by. Um, and it wasn't even like trial and error or whatnot. Because they already had L'Oreal in the store. And it was just seeing, you know, how they can do what's, um, seeing you know, about foundations or whatnot because they wanted to up the L'Oreal merchandise or selection brand, whatever you want to call it. And she said their L'Oreal line is based off of whatever, you know, whatever they send them. So, yeah. But it is, I totally agree with you, it is very frustrating at times, especially I can see if it's a line and you're going to sell something from that line, I feel as though you need to sell everything the whole lot not just one just not just one thing for example if even if you just go with um what you call that la colors you know they show 
sell shadows, nail polishes, or whatnot. In my Dollar Tree, they just started selling the baked eyeshadows. And then they started selling the nail polishes. It's flushing when you know about a line or whatnot, and you go in and be like, oh, let me check out their nail polish. They don't have nail polish. All they got is the eyeshadows. You know, stuff like that. I feel as though if you're going to carry something, you should carry the whole, you know, name brand or whatever. But yes, girl, you ain't the only one. And you know what, though? But I, I appreciate you for doing that video because at first I thought it was just me. And I say all the time when I'm watching somebody haul videos, I swear I think I live in the wrong state or the wrong part of the state. Because some of you, like the LA Colors uh, 3, the, the trios, that's not even sold around here anywhere. But yeah, um, so yeah, I hope that helps. Everybody, please leave your comments below, video response. Let us know what's going on in your neck of the woods. And as always, you be blessed, stay encouraged, and most of all, you stay beautiful. Peace out, one love.